rejected first lines for the new Harry Potter book. Don't you realise, Ron, said Harry, with our magic powers, we simply won't need Rehypnol. <laughs> it was October, and the beginning of Harry's fifth term at Feltham Young Offenders Institute. <laughs> I'm sorry, Harry, said Ron. I, I thought you felt the same way. <laughs> I am Lord Voldemort, and I am an alcoholic. <laughs> Commercials that never made it to air. Masturbation. Are you getting your five a day? Thirty-one million names on three great discs. Her Majesty's Revenue and Customs. Now that's what I call a monumental cock-up, Volume 1. <laughs> Things that would change the atmosphere at a dinner party. Don't worry, we don't say grace. We just sacrifice a child to the great god Imhotep. <laughs> well, this is absolutely lovely. I say we all raise a glass to the floor! <laughs> Things you wouldn't hear in a travel documentary. <laughs> this squawk of parrots, parakeets and toucans has kept me awake all bloody night. <laughs> so, I, Sir Jimmy, <laughs> am in the Gobi Desert looking for water, and fortunately I have found this waddy waddy. <laughs> Lines you wouldn't hear in a war film. Why are we speaking English? <laughs> I'm saving Private Ryan. Money on his car insurance. <laughs> Don't worry, Tommy. I'll, I'll make sure she gets it. It's chlamydia, isn't it? <laughs> Things you wouldn't hear on the radio. And now it's the panel show where our panel try to stave off premature ejaculation. Yes, it's just a minute. <laughs> In that episode of the Hugh Dennis story, Hugh Dennis was played by Bruce Willis, Steve Punt was played by Hugh Dennis, and the band was Shawaddy Waddy. <laughs> Unlikely lines from children's books. Yes, it is sad. I used to be on Top Gear, said, <laughs> said Stick of the Dump. The railway children gesticulated wildly at the driver. You've left us behind, you wanker! <laughs> I want to go to Tottenham, said Max. That's where the wild things are. <laughs> <laughs> Unlikely lines to hear in a kid's film. Where's Nemo? Look inside the batter. <laughs> Unlikely things to hear from a sports commentator. So just 80 metres to go and the building of this running track will be finished. <laughs> well, we'll have to see what the referee gets out. I don't think any of us were expecting that. <laughs> Bad things to say at a wedding. Please, please, Pavarotti, <laughs> let me go on top. <laughs> People have said to me, why have you stopped being a bachelor after so long? And I say, well, look at her. She's wealthy and she's dying. <laughs> so, good question. Gordon Brown, why don't you shove your tax increases up your ass? <laughs> Bad things to hear on opening the door in the middle of the night. Mm. Hello, I'm Daryl O'Brien. I'd like to talk to you about Mock the Week. <laughs> things you wouldn't hear in a medical documentary. <laughs> the Siamese twins were joined in the most embarrassing place imaginable and known by friends as the skipping rope. 